At the start of this raid, there is an escort mission. Like all escort missions, they are simple yet tedious. But on the upside, there is a secret chest. When you first load in, you will be greeted by Seraphun. Destroy her, then the doors behind will open. If you have completed the preservation mission, this first encounter is almost identical. Except there will be a few more enemies and three knowledge bearers instead of one. Beat the knowledge bearers, then nodes of knowledge will spawn in. You have to collect these and bring them back to the barge. When all nodes are collected, the barge will move to the next location. When you're away from the barge, you'll get a debuff called Profade in Darkness. If it reaches times 10, you will fall over. There is no revive restrictions, so you can be picked up or respawn at any time. You can hold three nodes of knowledge at a time. Stand next to the barge to deposit them and cleanse yourself of Profade in Darkness. Barge stops five times in total. Now for the secret chest. When the barge stops for the first time, the node you need to shoot will be behind you in this corner. When you stop for the second time, the node will be up and around this corner. And when you stop for the third time, the node will be under this bridge accessed from the other side. Fourth stop is where you can claim your loot by entering the right hand building and going to the back of the room. When you have completed this encounter, the barge will disappear into a doorway and open the pyramid. It's now time to learn another language.